WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a sunny, still cool, Del Rey Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a sea of red on the last trading day of the year. You've got the Dow down 36 points, one tenth percent. S&P's off a quarter percent or 11 points, about four tenths for the NASDAQ, 167 points, one percent for the Russell. That's a 22 point move. Semis are down 32. That's three quarters of a percent. You've got gold trading off 10 bucks. Silver's down 25 cents. Silver's down a little over one percent, but it has found support. Uh, you've got uh, lights we crude basically flat natural gas is off four pennies 30-year treasury down six pips trading out at 124.30 let's go take a look what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart we begin upper left hand corner of the es mini actually what we're going to see here is a new profile that is attempting to form and we'll talk more about that during the trader's edge show but right now you've got potential support at, excuse me 4792 resistance 4841 Spot volatilics is traded above yesterday's high. If it remains above that, we will close in the red. So you want to take a look at that. Yesterday's high, by the way, for the spot volatilics was the 1265 mark. The NQ also attempting to form a new profile. Now, you'll notice, and it may be hard to see, it might be easier when we take a look at my other charts. These new profiles that are forming are above the prior profile. That's a bullish signal from a profile's perspective. Nonetheless, support for the NQ right now, 16839, 17165 is resistance. Now, these new profiles will not be confirmed until Tuesday. If we take a look at the U.S. dollar index, yesterday it confirmed a Rhodes momentum indicator bottom. Today, we have a new profile. Price, you can't see it on this screen, but it's testing this oscillator and change line. For the most part, a close above 10109, that's the center of its bullish structured daily profile would signal move up to 102.26. Goldilocks also attempting to form a new profile. Right now it's trading into its resistance zone. That zone is between 2072.80 and 2085.50. Support down at 2041.10. Silver, as I had mentioned, it is trading lower, but it did find support at the bottom of its bullish structure daily profile. And that's between 2390 and 2412. If we take a look at light speed crude, very likely targeting the bottom of that daily profile at 7014. Natural gas, it's just an inside day. When you have an inside day, if that's how it ends up to be, that typically suggests that the trend that's in place should continue. Well, that would be a move to the upside. 30-year Treasury, right now testing support. That support is the top of its daily profile. And that's at the 12409 level. If price were to close below that, 12302 or 12215 becomes the price target. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you have to start your Friday, have a fantastic one, a fantastic New Year's weekend celebration. And we'll look forward to being with you again soon. Take care now.